Governor Brewer, at the recent conference, the governor of California, Governor Reagan, had asked the governors to pass a resolution regarding federal investigation to learn if there is any nationwide plot behind campus demonstrations. This is uh, some indication that uh, there uh, is uh, some uh, coalition or coordination of these efforts between uh, certain student groups in this country uh, that are activists and militant uh, in their approach to some of these problems. Uh, many of the other uprisings uh, uh, do not uh, smack of this same character. That is, they're purely local and self-contained in their nature. Uh, the governors all expressed uh, great concern about this problem. I think most of them have at their command resources to get the information that the Reagan resolution would have sought to uh, have obtained from uh, the president or through agencies that might be designated by the president. However, I don't see any great defeat uh, in the fact that the governors didn't adopt the Reagan resolution, though I supported it personally, uh, because I think that this information is presently being compiled by appropriate federal agencies as well as state agencies and is available to all interested parties, specifically including the governors of the respective states. With the House, Walter Flowers uh, is a member of the House Judiciary Committee, a very important committee, and all of the other members of the uh, House are, are serving on uh, very important committees, important not only to the people of Alabama, but indeed to the country. Uh, our senators uh, serve on important committee committees. Senator Allen was extremely fortunate in getting a choice committee assignments for a freshman senator. And I just believe that the delegation uh, has an excellent opportunity to do great service for the people of Alabama, and I'm convinced that they're dedicated to this uh, end. Uh, we discussed informally, of course, a great many problems uh, that the congressmen face as they relate to Alabama and to their respective districts, uh, and problems that the state faces as they relate to the federal government. And I'm looking forward to working with this outstanding congressional delegation as we try to seek solutions uh, working together to these problems. Well, now that you're back home, will you be delving deeply again into the problems of education, meeting with legislators again? Yes, we, are, we uh, will have to analyze and are now in the process of analyzing all of the suggestions and ideas and comments that were made in our meetings with the members of the legislature. Uh, hopefully from these we'll be able to put together uh, the ideas and thoughts of a majority of those uh, with whom we conferred and hopefully be able to start another round of conferences with the members of the legislature within the next 10 days or so. Uh, and at that time, uh, we hope that we can reach substantial accord in hammering out a final program that we can offer to the legislature in a special session. Can I ask you one final question, Governor, in regards to the prison investigation you've, uh, that you've just ordered? Uh, well, can you tell me why this was brought about on your part? Well, I didn't order the investigation myself, George. The uh, Board of Corrections, uh, the five Alabama citizens who serve as members of the board, and of course this is a, a type of civic rent that these gentlemen pay because they don't receive compensation for serving on the Board of Corrections, but they are charged with the responsibility of the overall administration of the prison system in our state. Uh, talked with me uh, last week about uh, the publicity that, had, that the prison system had received, uh, charges about uh, misconduct in connection with the operation of the system. And uh, in discussing this, uh, asked me uh, if we would make available the resources of the state toward an investigation. And uh, of course I assented uh, quite readily to this request on the part of the board and uh, the Department of Public Safety has made its investigators available and the uh, investigation is being conducted by the board itself and at the board's request. Uh, I shouldn't say by the board, it's by the department, but it is at the board's request and the request of the board for this department to make it. This request was made by...